Hey everyone, it's Chris. Sorry, I didn't have my usual setup, so you're just going to see a mess. These are just a couple of the cards I've made recently. I was making cards today. Doing some stamps. This, they need a little something else, so to find some pretty words to put on them or know, maybe... I think I might go around the edges with some gold. Just do a gold ring around the edge. I think is what I'm going to do. That one's pretty. I do love that stamp. It's um, three stamps. So you do the base layer. And then you do this little inside layer. And then you do the darker layer. Well, And then there's two for the in middle here. That's a long one. This one uses multi different uh, different ones than I had. Oh, here's another one I did the other day. What's brewing? I do like the way that turned out. I wasn't sure if I liked the way the coffee cups came out, but I'm okay with it. This was another one. I'm okay with that. It kind of looks 3D in the camera, but this was like six layers of stamping, which is a bit much. Um, I can take you for a quick peek outside through my screen. I can admire my new screen. I replaced. I, get the screen open. I replaced all the screens on my house. The last couple weeks, my garden is kind of put to bed. There's just a few tomatoes left over here, but this was all tomatoes and squash. And I had a dirt pile here that we spent all summer moving, and I got some wood chips dumped about a month ago, and I got those all moved. And then there's, these are all pots down here. There are beets and peas are in them. So, so I'm happy with the way that looks. So that's where I'm at right now. I'm gonna put you back in. But yeah, we, my mom and I replaced quite a few screens and then the next week we did a couple more and then my husband helped us do a couple and then on the third time I my husband and I just did them but man it's really hard on my hands really really hard on my hands we used um cat screening oh, here's some Christmas cards I did I haven't shown I can show you these we used cat screening which was very thick and heavy these are not to be mailed because it's got this wood piece on it, so that would be difficult. And then on the inside, Happy Holidays from. So there's just a bunch of these. I used some washi tape. Um, all this stuff, except for the paper, are stuff that I got from a garage sale that I went to different washi tapes I was using. These are um, stickers I had and some papers. These are using up some old stickers, the trees, and some washi tape. Just trying to get things done. These all have something bulky on them. So I, these are to be hand delivered. These are cork, so they're not so bad. That one needs a sentiment inside. I'll have to go back through. I thought they all had one of these things on them. So they all have something, except for that one. I'll have to go back in and add that. I was just finding stuff and trying to use stuff up. These are some old stickers and some new stuff I found. The Jingle Bells are the old stickers. Snowflake stickers are from Creative Memories, so they're quite old. And the Jingle Bells. Uh, I've done a bunch of cards for the nursing home. Oh, I can show you what their card is for January. And I've made a bunch and I sent them off so you didn't get to see them. Oh no, this one didn't stick right. I'm having a hard time getting my glue to stick. 
Bear with me here while I fix this one. Um, this is not a good example because it's missing the sentiment. Let's another one. So this is the nursing home card for January. So I just have a stamp in the corner and then it says celebrate National Trivia Day alone or together. And then I just took a Trivial Pursuit card out of a game and I made a little pocket and it tucked it in there. I could move the pocket a little bit bigger, but I didn't want them all falling out. So I have to print off some more of the Celebrate National Trivia Day alone or together because some of them just don't have that. And I didn't want to hand write it. But I thought that was a cute way to use up some of those Trivial Pursuit cards because who doesn't have boxes and boxes of those downstairs in their basements or... You can find them at thrift stores like crazy. And it's like, what do you do with them all? We don't play it anymore. My husband can give me every pie piece on the puzzle on the game. And he can still beat me. I just have to get it in the center and answer a question. And I can never do it. So I, I give up. But So that's what I've been up to. Some things. I did make a blanket. An Afghan grafgan for a co-worker. Maybe I'll videotape it tomorrow without any real verbiage because I'll be at work. And then I'll just post it. I don't edit, so there won't be any saying with it. I'll just post a picture of it. But that's some of the stuff I've been up to. It's been a crazy summer. Um, when it's summertime, I'm outside working all the time. When I'm not working at work. So... I haven't had a lot of videos, but that's where I've been. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.